Morning, Kev. Morning, Alan. How you doing? We're doing great. Guess where we are? We are at West Point, Peterborough. We are. Kevin, over to you. Well, you can probably guess behind us we've got some trucks. Today is the Wisbeach and District Historic Vehicle Club's annual road run. Woo! <laughs> the only problem today, we're going to have to be quick because the cars come in, we've got to film them, and then they're going to leave within about an hour, is it? Yeah, about an hour. So then they're going to go on to their next stop. So uh, we better get a, a wiggle on, shall I say? Well, get round them. <laughs> Let's have a look. Let's have a look what's here. Oh, he's still doing it. Do I, I can't he's believe it. He's pulled it. Still doing it. Pulled out again. Oh dear. Oh. The, these two cars over here. This guy in the darker car has tried to reverse in about seven or eight times now. I'm getting the feeling he's one of these guys that's never had an accident in his life but has been the cause of multiple. We did get here a little bit early and they're just starting to come in the door. But look at this. Can't beat a good old beetle.
Yeah, he's missed the turning. Back up. <laughs> Follow the instructions too well. <laughs> cars are here now guys yep so uh i've already picked my favorite car i think i've picked mine uh, i'm still undecided <laughs> there's a few nice ones that uh, are on my shortlist so we've got a best probably 30 minutes to walk around this lot yeah probably less than that so we're gonna have to do a quick sweep um i need to try and find where my favorite car parked up i did see it come in um do you know where yours parked alan nope okay well we'll just have a look along the line and see what we can have a look at so we've got a, a good spectrum of ages and types of vehicle once again. We always get a good mix on this Rover. Oh, nice Ooh, Fiesta, Fiesta there. That's lovely, isn't it? 1980 on a W, Mark 1. Very nice Volkswagen Beetle. That's in lovely condition, that is. Low, low Max. Little Low Max with a Citroen 2CV engine. Triumph Stag. I did like the old Triumph. Triumph Stag was a unique looking vehicle, wasn't it? Great styling. There's a nice bit of quality about them as well. Yes. And a lovely rumble of V8 engine, of course. Your favourite van, Kevin? I know. The Bedford CA. I love seeing these. Beautiful van, 1965. <laughs> Jag. Reliant Scimitar GTE. Very cool. Oh. Yeah. And I've just seen here. That's beautiful nice. Ford Escort Twin Cam. Wow. That's Mark one. arguably my favourite Mark One Ford Escort. Everyone raves about the Mexico, yeah. but I do love the Twin Cam. Beautiful car oh, that is. Depends who to. Triumph Herald. Yeah. Not a convertible though. No. Or Triumph 2 500S. 
Now, I think this one here that we're approaching, this was your favourite last year, yes. Adam, wasn't it? Yes, it was. So I can't pick that one this year. Oh, here's another absolutely superb car. I do remember seeing this last year. Ford Capri S, 2 litre S on an A-Reg. So that's one of the last before they drop the S from the range. Beautiful. Porsche. Yeah. 944 Turbo. Ford console. I remember looking at this Zodiac last year as well. Which I think was an Abbott estate, wasn't it? Oh, and a lovely jacket here. Mm -hmm. These were certainly a car in their day. I was never keen on them, but they're kind of like growing on me over the years. Yeah, I like them. I do like the styling. It's very distinctive. <laughs> the old Rover 800. I wonder if that's got the V6 in it, or just a 2 litre. 1999, so that's what, 24 years old already now, isn't it? Local car as well, FL registration. Nice to see a proper bumper MG. BMW X1? Yeah. That'll be a classic one, though. Well, there's a classic today. This is a nice lavender blue Jaguar, isn't it? Um, XJ6 Mark II, 1975, local car again, EG, Peterborough registration. Ah, now we're into Allen territory with the Volkswagen buses again. That, they've got the split screens in these. These are old ones. These are older. Yeah, well, here an old screen. <laughs> something you don't see every day. Oh, no. Senator. They, with a three litre engine, went like shit off a shovel. Yeah. yeah. Greg one was a taxi once. He'd do dung ups in the middle of the high school. Yeah. 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 They eventually yeah. wrote it off, yeah. put it in the ditch yeah. upside yeah. down, but right. it did go. my favourite BMW of all time. 1998, 735i. It's definitely not part of the show. No. Cool though. Bit of a rarity though. Yeah. Don't see so many of these now. Nice tangerine or orange colour. That's had the retrofitted, that's a 1981 on an X, that's had the retrofitted chrome grille, so a lot of owners do tend to do that. Oh, nice little mini, Mayfair. 89 or 90 on a G. Whoa. Now I, I like this. Escort Mexico. Hint, 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 Mark hint. Two. Beautiful. That this looks like um, Signal Amber or Signal Orange, I think the colour is. That's a lovely car. I seem to forget how small wheels used to be. I know. Today's standards are very small, aren't they? <laughs> they are 13 inch wheels. They were quite uh, quite a standard size back then, weren't they? I do like this car though. It is very nice. A lovely example. 
Mm. Mark II Mexico. You don't tend to see so many Mark II Mexicos, do you? No. Mostly the Mark ones. That is nice. That'd be a lot of fun. That's a, well, it's a nice sunny day. It's the sort of day you'd love to be ragging that round a beach somewhere, yeah, wouldn't you? We just ain't got a beach, have we? We haven't. Let's make do a bit of gravel on the floor here. <laughs> That's about as close as we're going to get. Oh, nice Nissan. Oh, that's a different kind of MG, isn't it? Someone's really put a bit of work into yeah. that. In fact, I don't ever ever recall what, seeing one of wheel arches no, that wide. I think that's a custom job, isn't it? I still haven't found it then. Now here is something that I've not seen before in real life and I've always wanted to see one. This is a mini special edition. This was the very first special edition mini that they made, 1979-1980. They only made it in two colours and I think this one was called Rose or something like that. It's a very cool car, isn't it? With the, it really is a, with the vinyl roof. A kind of strange, odd colour. It is. I love it. I absolutely love that. Sunbeam Alpine, yeah. Oh, and I love the badge on there. It says Sunbeam Roots Group. That's really nice. I like the wheels on that Triumph. Absolutely immaculate. I bet you the first who has to polish them. Yeah, they've had a lot of cleaning done to them, haven't they? <laughs> oh, beautiful Humber Scepter. Nineteen sixty three. Love the fog lamps with the yeah, the little period fog lamps with roots, roots group. written on yeah, so roots. that's a nice little touch. Roots group sadly long gone now. Oh yes, yes. They sound even older. Lovely old Yeah. Yeah, both Oh yeah. Yeah, what would you give to have a drive in one of these, Kevin? Yeah, I'd love yeah. to try that. That'd be great fun, wouldn't it? It'd be a bit tricky to try and drive it, I reckon. Yeah, I don't know if I'd want to actually drive it. I'd rather be a passenger, get chauffeured around in it. But, um, yeah. Yeah. There, it's something else that I've got in there. I love the little vent in the roof. It's got a little opening. I suppose that's like an early sunroof, isn't it? Yeah. Periscope up from there. Yeah. Chance. I've never seen it. Oh, and here's this lovely Cortina. More my era, yeah. Mark my Cortina. Two litre gear. That's a nice shade of brown as well. That is nice. It's going to be difficult choosing a favourite today amongst these ones. I do recall this estate Cortina yeah. last year. We, we did see that last year. And then we've got one and a half Volkswagen Golf. <laughs> That's what you call the cut and shut. Interesting. And of course, wouldn't be a road run without a Morris Minor, would it? No, certainly wouldn't. I do like a nice Lambretta. I can see you on this black one, Alan. I think that sort of suits you. That's smart. The Lambrettas were a bit longer at the back than the, than the Vespers. Yeah. But I think the Lambrettas had more style. And then we've got a whole line here. Beautiful BSA bikes. We've got one on the move.
Everyone's got naughty on the end there, that's nice. Let's try and find it. Well, I guess this is the big bit for today, Kev. There are all these trucks. It's not something we normally see. Absolutely. Where do you want to go? Anyway, it doesn't really matter. They're all nice. Oh, they? Oh, they? These are rather unusual. A couple of Dodge trucks we've got here. Max and Kev. Yeah, yeah. They seem to be firing up the engines, perhaps they're going to move in a moment. Well this is the trouble with this one, they're only here for a short while and then they're going to fly off again. It's a lot easier than keep messing about on the, the Italian button. job. You're only supposed to blow the bloody doors off. Yep. Fantastic film, one of my favourites. Well, your Michael Caine is a, is a lot older now. He is, yeah. What was that, 1969, I think, that film? Yeah, that's very old. Oh, we've got a cool recovery truck here. That looks purposeful. Another one of these ergonomic cabs. AEC again, beautiful. That's a nice truck, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, what a nice. There's got a big windscreen on those, haven't they? Good visibility. Yeah. It is a bit mesmerising, there's just trucks as far as you can see, isn't there? Well, I guess we'll go and 
I'll wait for them to start departing. Yeah, they'll be going, headed off in a couple of minutes, so we'll take up positions and watch them all depart. It's a nice program, isn't it? And a little Thames truck in the middle there. Now that I'll switch Hello. it off before you've got to film in it. How you doing? You alright? Nah, not so bad. Are you? Yeah, good. We spoke to this gentleman last year. Yep. Owner of this Leyland Octopus 2. Now, uh, you thought it had took the picture of the brighter one on the other side? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There's a brighter one on the other side. See? Well, look on the other side. The owner knows best better about John on the other side. It was... Oh, I see. There's more colour on this one. Oh, I see. The, um, yeah, yeah, I didn't know what you meant. <laughs> I did see you walking about the car show yeah, last yeah. weekend. Yeah, last weekend. <laughs>
Come on guys, we've got an outro to do yet. We have, but we're, uh, we're just enjoying a lovely <laughs> hot dog from Cole's Kitchen. Fantastic. And we just met Emma here. Hello Emma. Hello, How nice to meet you all. So a massive thank you to you for the hot dogs. You're right. welcome, You've you're welcome. You've done a great, great job today serving everybody. Thank you very yeah. much. Had a busy morning, yeah? We have, yes, very busy and very hot. <laughs> Good, lots of vehicles. <laughs> lots yeah. of nice vehicles in, yeah. Yeah. Well, thanks for these, we're going to finish food. eating these. The food was fantastic. Thank, thank you, really thank you very much. much. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Much appreciated. So we'll... Uh, yeah, the, the, the last problem is, where's mine? Sorry. Yeah, where is it? I can see it. It's behind you, as they say in all good pantomimes <laughs> and several bad ones. Yeah. Yeah. Well, no, no, the hot dogs are bloody gorgeous. They are. Yeah. So we're we're going to finish eating these, and then the all important question is, we're going to pick our favourite vehicle. That's right. right. So we're going to do it now. In a minute, when we've eaten these. Cheers. <laughs> Thank, you, Thank, you. Thank, Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, guys. Well, all the vehicles have left as quickly as they arrived. Yeah. yeah. The big question is, what's your favourite cars? Vivian's got to be you first. Well, um, I have to stay with Fords again, um, and mine was the Mark II Escort Mexico in that lovely orange colour. I don't know the name of it, the name of the, the colour of the... Do you know that, Kevin? Well, that? I couldn't determine whether it was signal orange or signal amber, but it, I think it was one of the signals. <laughs> but it was, yeah, beautiful car, that. Yeah. So that was my favourite of the show. Very that's, good. That's, a, that's a very good choice, Vivian. Thank you. Very good choice. Thank you. Kev? Me? Okay. Um, I'm going to think a little bit outside the box. I'm going to pick the Lavender Blue Jaguar XJ 1975. I really love that colour on those Jaguars. And that was a superb example. So that's my choice. That's, that's a very good choice. So, Alan, down to you then. If this was a game of Snap, me and you, Vivian, would be winning. <laughs> right. but no, I, I, I've gone for the uh, for the orange marks of Escort Mexico as well. <laughs> I didn't I didn't know Vivian was going to pick that car, but he did. So uh, it shows that we're live. You see, I mean, this is it, it was a nice car. It was it a was, lovely car. Yep. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so that's it. Another day over. That's, that's it. it. Another show done. Thank so, you very much for watching. Thank you. I guess and we'll see you all in the next one. Yeah, till the next time. See, see ya. ya.